Hi everyone, in this video I want to show you a comparison between G-Translate, Wiglot and WPML to translate your WordPress website. We go now to the screen. Here I will talk you fast of Wiglot. I already used the free days of Wiglot and it was actually pretty good but the thing is that it is a more expensive option and another thing that I didn't like is that the count of words it's quite limited so if you're on a big budget you should go for it because it's a very good automatic translation that you can get also another thing to keep in mind is that as you increase the service pack that you choose from them you will have also a limited amount of translation languages you can try it with a free trial I already did that but honestly there are other options if you're a blogger and you don't want a very high end uh, solution then Wiglot might not be for you this might be more like for big businesses also here I have as an example G-Translate which is a very good uh, automatic translation service the only thing that it's quite limited in the exact content that you want to translate yes it helps you with the subdirectory URL structure but you have to pay six dollars per month it's really easy to use if you're just aiming for a quick translation or you don't care for the somehow the big quality you translate could be an option and the one that I'm using is WPML it's one of the most common thing uh, plugin that you can use they have several uh, services either the blog CMS or agency it's also different according to the type the number of websites that you're going to translate plus also if you're aiming for other more specific features like translating widgets or if you want a proper structure of your translators and you have like several people working on it you can give the work and split the work of the translation so that's also really good for and also one thing that I want to make clear when you're deciding which translation plugin you, you want to use you must have in consideration the other plugins that you already have installed on your WordPress environment so they don't have like this uh, unsynchronized or they're not compatible with each other the thing with WPML is that it is compatible with Elementor and it's a WordPress website builder and it can help you to improve your web design so this can help you also to quick translate and don't lose this web design that's why I prefer to use WPML uh, the other websites there are you have to really look and be careful if they are compatible with your plugins so if you don't know which one I would recommend WPML because of that reason the compatibility but if you're on a budget you can go for Wiglot or if you just want to have a quick translation G-Translate might be an option but if you're looking for international SEO and Elementor compatibility WPML could also be a good reason to get it so if you have more questions don't hesitate to contact me